Hey, bro. Hit my intro. What's happening, my visionaries? It's your man, J. Rock. I'm back in effect. I'm live and direct, and I'm coming at your neck with that ain't nothing. Video, 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 baby. Ah. The video, man, as always, just like, subscribe if you want to. If you don't, then just do it if you want to do it, because Jesus said this is the right thing to do. What's happening, my visionaries? It's your man, J. Rob. I'm back up in this thing with another video, man. About to check out the Book of Knots. Palanimo. Featuring Mike Patton. So, I don't think that this is one of Mike Patton's multitude, one of his one of his various plethora uh, number of projects, but it could be. Um, but it is featuring him, so maybe this is just a separate band or a separate group just featuring Mike Patton on the song but yeah um y'all know who it's courtesy of like I said and I'm explaining this again for people that I'm not gonna explain it on this one I'll explain it on another video anyway the book of knots plan mo feature Mike Patton let me put on my headphones for true man we gonna do what it do let's do it Like the eerie synth chords at the beginning, building up the atmosphere. My name is My name is like that vintage, vintage uh, vinyl sampler quality to it. poetic lyrics It sounds like what happened when you ingest too many bath salts. Okay. Like the text from that synth chord, man. Droning, deep, deep pad. Reminds me a little bit of you, uh, if anybody knows who the Swans are, uh, the lead singer from the Swan, Michael Gira, Gira. his uh, his solo music, this kind of reminds me somewhat of something he would do, or maybe even some Swans type stuff, you know, uh, the more, well, I don't, I don't actually know how to, uh, <laughs> how to characterize or accurately characterize uh, Swans music, but this, it, it kind of has that, that similar sound, sometimes droney. Sometimes more almost post rock like Godspeed, You Black Emperor, that that particular style, but more droning, almost like doom metal, but uh, not as heavy. Get back to it though. Hey, 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 hey. 
Not a new wavy post wave. I killed the vocals, man. <laughs> I'm really liking the, the latter part of this track, the end of this track. Distortion on the Santa Cores. That it? Oh, that's it. That was gonna be more than that. But uh, yeah, not too bad, man. Not too bad. So I mean, with something like this, it's uh, it's hit or miss. Right now, it's it's not not really hitting for me. But kind of reminds me somewhat of uh, you know, like the drone metal, the doom metal. Like if you listen to band, I like bands like Suno. You know, uh, Electric Wizard, you know, stuff like that. I like the doom metal kind of stuff. It's not as heavy, um, but it's it's still somewhat heavy. Got a very sinister, uh, ethereal tone to it. Hence the name, uh, Planimo, which is, <laughs> yeah. But it's got a kind of ethereal quality to it, but it's sinister. You know, it's, it sounds like something is creeping up on you by the way the chords are being played and the stuff like that. The distortion, the saturation on the on the on the on the, on the keys, and it's it's. It's pretty cool, man. It's kind of it's almost uh, vampiric. Uh, reminds me of like Nick Cave on Mescaline or something. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Nick Cave on Mescaline. Iggy Pop on Crack. Or maybe he was. I don't know. <laughs> not too bad though, man. Uh, I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm not sure if this is one of Mike's bands. Many, you know, he has a multitude of iterations. I'm not sure if this is one of those. But uh, let's see. Planimo, noun, plural planimos, astronomy, an astronomical object with enough mass to achieve hydrostatic equilibrium, but not enough to initiate core fusion any time in existence. That is, it is the round. It is that is, it is rounded in shape and is smaller than a star. Hmm. Yeah, that, that those those uh, those those vocals at the end, the high E, that was nice. Mike's got some. Mike's got underrated vocal range, man. You gotta give the man his respect as far as vocal wise, because I mean, he was killing that last part. Like I said, that latter part of the that, the song is what I was really digging. But anyway, if you like it, leave a like. Want to hear me do some more stuff? Somebody said that all I do is popular stuff. I'm like, come on, no, come on. What are you talking about? Look at my, <laughs> look at the recent songs I do. I barely do popular. I barely. I mean, every once in a while I do a popular song, but I barely do popular stuff. I mostly do underground stuff, and it's courtesy of you guys. I have I can't take no credit on that. You guys are the one that showed me this stuff. I would never have found this without y'all. I have some very kind of esoteric taste that comes in music, uh, but a lot of this stuff I wouldn't have found without y'all. So I appreciate it. God bless y'all. We on the road to twenty k, man. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to, leave a like. If you don't, hey, do your thing, man. And it's with that, mm, and as always.
Bitch, your name is salute to you. Remember, I always say best never stress. I always always do your very best. Live, love, love life. Because why? Because life is beautiful. That's why I'm going to catch y'all on the flip side. Whew. No, my hands are red. Don't ask why. Don't ask. Deuces.